Hello there, welcome to VC27. It's wicked, yes, I don't have him loose. This is the Vintage Collection Quick Shot Series, episode 27. It is VC27. Wicked. The time of making this video, my mind is spinning because I've just had the New York Toy Fair and I've been looking at all the activity there. I'm just <laughs> conscious of my bank balance. There's so much I want to buy. The barge is maybe going to come out in the UK. So there's a lot on my mind, but anyway, we're trying to get through, or trying to get through, I'm enjoying doing this series of videos, the Quick Shot series. I'm just racing through the vintage collection. Unfortunately, this guy, I do not have loose. So, I do have him on card there. I wished I had him loose, I swear to God I do, because he looks amazing. Great figure. Another good figure you can get of Wicket is the Power of the Force 2 one, which is very good. I've heard people actually say that they, they think that one is the best. So here's the original card on the background, on the back. Uh, Wicket W Warwick, which has now been changed changed to just Wicket. There you go. So very nice, 1983 to 85. I never had a Wicket original figure back in the day. I did have, I think, Log Ray or somebody like that. Or maybe even Timo. Now that's another idea for the future, some more vintage collection. Um, I was going to say Jowers then. Ewoks would be quite nice, I think. There's definitely a couple more. Chief Charper is an idea, and Tibu. I couldn't remember his name the other day. I called him Tibbet. But look at that figure. It doesn't have to be loose to showcase how good he is. I can just zoom right in on that amazing... Look at the eyes, are great. And there's, there's articulation there, the weapon and everything. So, great. And then bang for your buck there. They've managed to pack in a bit of extra plastic Hasbro, which is great. So there you are. And if you are new to my channel, and a fair few people have jumped onto my channel since my comments on the new retro line and the toy fair you know it's all algorithms isn't it on ebay ebay what the hell am i talking about youtube um so thank you for jumping on board welcome to only one kenobi only one uh, this, this series i'm trying to get to 500 subscribers and then the game begins ladies and gentlemen i am going all the way from vc01 all the way to vc115 this is number 27 and if you can guess the closest to how many you think i have carded and how many I have carded and loose, obviously this one I only have him carded, then you will win the prize and there will be a giveaway. The item of which will be announced when I hit 500, so help me get there. Thank you for subscribing. This has been Only One Kenobi. Only One. Join in at 8pm tomorrow for another episode. Out. Hello there, we're not done yet. <laughs> There's just one more thing I want to say. Uh, there are two variants of this card. I only have one. There is a revenge variant as well. I have the return and it is, as you can see, unpunched. I love that. You can't beat an unpunched card. The revenge variant, there was a situation where I could have won one on eBay, but it slipped me by. We've all had a situation like that in our lives, I'm sure. And then the other thing is I wanted to say that when I do hit 500, 500 subscribers, I will let you know exactly where we are up to. So if we're on episode 29 or 30, depending on how quick it comes around, I will let you know how many out of that 30 of the vintage collection I have loose and carded, so you can guess how many out of the 115 I have loose and carded, and then the game will begin. <clears throat> Excuse me, for the second time, I shall say again, this has been Only One Kenobi. Only One, out.